Hi guys, welcome to MS Power Automate. In today's video, I will be sharing how to integrate Teams to get approval using Microsoft Power Automate. Our current use case, we are going to read email that contains the subject of new invoice. Next, extracting the information via AI Builder. I will not go through in detail for the AI Builder. You can follow the steps from one of our videos on how to use the AI Builder in Power Automate. Lastly, integrate with Teams to get approval. Okay, so first of all, we are going to create a new solution. Select the default publisher. Afterwards, we are going to create a new automated cloud flow. Give a name here. And then we will select when a new email arrives. As for now, I'm using Outlook 365. So I will select this option. Okay, so now under show advanced option, I would like to filter it to include attachment, only with attachment, and the subject that contains new invoice. Okay, so now the next step is to extract the information via AI Builder. Okay, so from here, I'm required to select my AI Builder and then the form type, I can select maybe for now, I just select as PDF document. No. And then from Next, we are going to add an action inside this apply to each and select post. Let me select this first and we search for post of choice of option as the bot flows to the user. So option one, we can make it as yes. The second option is no. Okay, and then the recipient we will send to from, and then the message we will include we have received. An invoice with amount of Okay, so now after we've done this step, the next step what we need to do is add an action and we select condition control. Over here, since we have selected a choice, we're going to use a type select, selected option is equals to yes. So over here, the value must be exactly the same as what we enter here, if it is case sensitive. And then the next step, then we can program it to actually, if yes, what we're going to do, we can run a desktop flow. If no, we can do a reply email to the user who sent the email. So let's give it a test.
Okay, if you want to take a look, this is how the invoice will look like. I will extract this information and then we will proceed on. You will see the value in on the teams. Okay, let's wait for a while. Okay, so from here is actually waiting. So from here, I'm able to see on the chat here. Power Automate sent me a card. It says, please approve this invoice. And then, yep, it's completed. So if you're keen to learn more, do remember to subscribe our channel as we have constant updates and tutorial videos on Microsoft Power Automate Desktop. Thank you.